hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talk video guys so um on today's video i'm going to show you guys how to um create a room and start a room on your facebook page so this is very similar to what i did on the previous video um where i showed you guys how to start a live room on facebook page but the live room on the mobile section is actually only audio but then this is actually totally different for, so whatever you did on the mobile is totally going to be different from this i don't know if this is actually a mistake from facebook um i do not know but um i think this particular facebook feature hasn't been perfected so probably they are going to improve later on and if they did i'm going to make more videos for you guys so let's dive in let me show you guys how to make use of the existing facebook um, room on your pc or probably a laptop if you have a laptop now go ahead and open the facebook page um the facebook uh website once it's open click on this drop down area to select that and then go ahead and click on switch profile to select the exact profile that you want to switch to so for my case i'm going to make use of ts tech talk and then i just selected that and i'm going to wait for it to load up now it has loaded up and if you notice um you can just scroll down a little bit although i'm already seeing it once you scroll down a little bit you are going to notice where it says new room or you are going to see rooms um actually these are the previous um rooms that i created although it's showing active but do not worry i already ended them so let me click on it to start a new room although you can always um rejoin this room anytime you want to whenever you click on join you join the room and you start um doing the activities in the room but i'm going to click on this and then um first guys you notice there is a room name so we have to give our room a name so i'm going to click on that and then on default this is actually the previous room i created this um is also um these are all the default um room names that are already existing so you can scroll down and select any particular one but i'm not interested in any of this so you also might not be interested in it so all you need to do is to click on new to create a new room name so you can click you can highlight on all of them and then delete and then type any name but i think i'm okay with that but then i'm going to actually change this room to just say um test so you guys will understand i'm just testing the stuff and then another thing you need to do is actually to select um the appropriate emoji that you think that is going to actually be fitting this particular tutor so i'm going to choose this one that has camera icon and i'm going to hit save once i'm done now um after that area you notice this area where it says start now i'm actually okay with the start now so if i'm okay with that i should just click on create room and then start creating the room but if for your case you do not want to start now you can actually click on this start now and then choose a particular date and time that you want your room to start but actually um i do not want to create this later on or in the future i just want to do this right now because this is actually a tutorial i want so i'm going to click on this one that says reset to now and then click save now you notice it says now right there so i'm just going to click on create room and then it will um, display an option where it shows me even more information about my room now the first thing you need to ac acknowledge right here is actually the link to the room once you click on it it copies the link you notice it says link copied right and now um there are even more things you guys will have to edit before you start the room you notice right there it says um only invited friends can join without request so you can click this area and then you can edit it to anyone so once you choose anyone anyone can join the room and then um that is it and then um you notice it says not visible on facebook messenger right this particular section cannot be edited for some reason i do not know why although there are some settings right here and you notice it can also not be edited but you notice the joint permission says anyone can join which is the one we just did and then this is just the editing of the name but there is actually no option for us to um actually edit this particular feature that says um visible to um facebook or messenger so this is actually not visible to people except to sh you share the link with them now um let's continue although it says anyone can join without request now let's continue so click on that and it's going to load up uh give it some minutes it's going to load up and then um the last time I actually tested this stuff i tried it and it doesn't actually display the room on 
it doesn't actually display the room on the mobile and right now i'm on my mobile phone and i refreshed on the facebook page is not actually displaying that do not worry guys let's just continue so you notice it says anyone with link can join that is actually what it means previously where he said anyone so i'm going to just go ahead and copy this again just to confirm that and i'm going to close this so um if you choose an option where um anyone in the okay i'm going to mute my mic if you choose an option where it says um anyone in the group uh can join without the link um that means um you have to invite them and approve right so if you actually choose where anyone can join anyone that has the link can join that means people can easily join and view um the stuff uh, and view the live um, by um by clicking on the link or uh, there is no way they are actually going to see this live streaming without um visiting even though they visit the facebook page there is no way they are going to know that we are currently live so the only thing you have to invite them and now the funny thing is whenever you click on this section um and then click on invite you don't easily get to see people displaying right there um i've tried it several times it loads up and loads up and doesn't display so um initially i did invite myself which is trust stanley but actually it didn't display here so what i actually did um i sent myself a message to the facebook page and i also replied to it so that is exactly what we are going to be doing i'm going to go over to the message section wait for it to load up and once it loads i'm going to just um click on the um, trust stanley and then paste the link to trust stanley so that um i will be able to see it on my mobile phone and then join making use of my mobile phone so this is trust stanley right there i'm just going to click on that it's already there and then i'm going to paste <coughs> and then hit enter now i just sent another link this is the previous one i sent so um let me use the other phone to actually join the live stream and i'm moving over to the messenger i've seen it i just clicked on the link and then um i'm continuing at trust stanley and it's now displaying so it's already displaying okay um okay so it's already displaying right now and then you can notice right there is displaying two different camera angle this is actually my phone right there you notice um i'm moving the phone around and then the one that is facing opposite is actually my laptop now um if for some reason guys because i turn off this ca um the mic if for some reason guys you actually want to turn off um the camera all you need to do is to click right there the camera will be turned off for you and on the device the person is actually going to be seeing my logo let me show you this is what the person is going to be seeing right there the logo and also anytime you want you can always end this by clicking on this particular section so um uh this is actually the only way that people can get to join the live and you notice right now it says two people here and the two people that are actually here is actually me and the um me and my profile as in my facebook page and my facebook um profile so this is just how it goes and you can always click on this area to start an activity and we can start a game together and there is a lot of cool things we can do we can also chat probably because um maybe our audio is not working properly we can click on chat and then start a chat and then there is actually not much thing so i would not say this is actually very cool compared to the previous um tutorial i made for the audio live room so and depending on whatever you're doing i think the audio live room is actually the best um to gain a lot of audience because this right here only actually allows people that you invite and this is actually not very cool so this is all you can do on the facebook room on the pc version which is totally um for uh friends it's supposed to be only for um personal profile but for some reason they added this for facebook page and even though they added it for facebook page is still not working the way it should or maybe they are going to improve this later on but right now this is just what we got and guys if they improve on this particular feature later on i'm going to make more video about it but so far this is what we get this is what we got and then also guys um um I would encourage you guys to actually make use of the mobile version if you want to gain a lot of audience but if you want to have um probably uh um if you want to have a conversation or um you want to reserve a meetup with somebody i think this is actually very okay so um this is all i want to share with you guys on today's video this is just how to um um 
go to the uh, start a room on your Facebook PC, which is totally different from the mobile. So if you are okay with this um, and you want to end the video, just click on this red um, icon right here. Click on that and I just ended the room. And you notice it says we should give it um, a thumbs up or probably schedule, but I will not say not now. So I'm okay with that. So that is all I want to show you guys on today's video. And if you guys are okay with this video, please smash like and subscribe to the channel. And guys, I'm going to see you on my next video. Please stay safe and peace.